All right, so here's a little short video um, of the truck. I'm gonna go around it, open the hood, we'll take a look at the interior, talk about a couple things. Uh, first time making a video, trying to sell a vehicle, so I'm not quite sure what to say. Anyways, uh, so we'll start front to back. Uh, let's see here. All right, so the front end is just typical GMC. Um, I did put LED headlights. They are very bright, work really well. Um, the bumper, um, I took off the bumperettes, uh, so I haven't put carriage bolts in there yet, but um, I do have the bumperettes just in case anybody likes that look, then they can put that look on there. Uh, I got a new air dam down here on the bottom. Uh, it gives it a little ground hugging little look. Um, side markers are also new. Um, the American Racing wheels are new with uh, Nitto tires. These are the uh, 555 G2s. I'm not exactly sure uh, what the tread wear or anything like that is. Um, but uh, they ride pretty good. Uh, got new emblems on the side. The truck did not have emblems on the side. Nor did it have the side moldings um, on the truck when I bought it. So I put those on. And then the stainless side mirrors. I also added those. Um, I guess we can sight down the side of the truck it's pretty darn good for a 30 something year old if i'm doing my math right but uh the truck is a driver it's got little you know nicks uh little paint chips uh missing in a couple spots there's another one right there the uh quarter glass of course or side triangle window, I don't know what you call them. Um, that needs to be sanded and painted. Um, there's another little missing little paint chip right there somehow. But, uh, and you have to excuse the truck, it is pretty dirty right now. Um, I need to wash it, but I've been, I do drive it. I really enjoy driving it, so. Um, you know, uh, it is an, uh, an enjoyable truck to drive. So let's go back over here, let's see if we can find any rust um there's no rust right here in the front fender no rust down here either go along the rocker uh it's pretty clean and down here on this one there is no rust either um it does have some rust right here there's a very slight bubbling of the paint right there. I'm not sure if you can catch that, but there is a little bit of bubble. Um, and then right here, I guess where the old trim was, uh, when it came off or they peeled it off or whatever, paint came off. Um, again, just trying to point out everything. I did put new tail lights on it uh, with little stainless uh, trim rings around them. The uh, stainless trim ring is uh, separate. I put a new tailgate panel and a new back bumper. Um, haven't got around to tuck in the bumper because of that gap, but I'll probably end up doing that. Um, the truck does have a tonneau cover. Comes in handy, but if you don't like it, you can take it off. Uh, sorry for my finger there. Uh, the truck has a little um, bed line mat, but it also has a brand new bed line, and you can see how clean that is. Uh, and underneath the mat, it is a brand spanking new um, bed liner. Done really well. Um, just needs a little bit of a wash. It's, it's dusty, but you can see that the, the bed isn't beat up. The, the uh, wheel wells aren't beat up. And this, there you go, the side of the front side of the bed looks perfect. All right. So coming along to this side, um, same thing. Truck looks pretty, pretty decent. You can sight down the side of it. Um, there is some rust right here. You see that? Looks like somebody just bondoed over it or something. Uh, coming a little bit forward, there is not any bubbling there or anywhere along. This rocker. 
and none on the fender right there. Um, another new emblem, side mirrors. Come to the front, another side marker, new side marker, and no rust there. So just a couple of spots um, where there's some rust. And come back around the front. Again, more new headlights, the other side. Bumper's pretty straight. Um, has a little staining from where the bumper it's been for 30 something years. But, uh, oh, I also have new LED um, side marker lights that I'll include. And there is one spot right here on the hood where the, uh, where the, uh, sorry, it almost got stung by a bee. Well, there's a little bit of rust and the paint was peeling. Other than that, the finish on the on the hood is a little bit. Let's see if we can get that. I don't know if that's what those bubbles are. Um, if something's reacting underneath the paint, it looks a little dull, as you can see. Almost like they started to wet sand it, but then stopped and never finished buffing it. Not quite sure. But there's the cowl. And I'm going to stop this video and start another one uh, under the hood. So I'll be back.